Hey folks, welcome to another Lifestyle with Ivan. I know it's been a minute, but since uh, the country started to open back up, things get a little crazy, get a little busier. Tonight, or this evening, I'm going to make something simple. I'm going to make some crack conch and some crack chicken. I'm going to show you how to do the crack chicken. Now here, I have five uh, eggs. I haven't added nothing to the eggs yet. I got them uh, the chicken, the chicken breast. There's a chicken breast, and I just uh, cut thin slices off the chicken breast, and I got the conch. So let us begin. Oh yeah, I got some all-purpose flour. I got some some milk. I got some baking soda and I got my seasoning. So let, let's begin. First I'm going to um, whip these eggs. I'm going to add some milk. them again I'm gonna add my seasoning I'm gonna add some garlic powder I'm gonna add some lemon pepper I'm gonna add some of this uh, Everglades heat. Then I'm gonna put some, uh, put a touch of little old bay in it. I'm gonna mix it all up, get all that seasoning uh, in there with the egg wash. Okay, those, like I said, those are the seasonings that, that I use. And then, uh, I got some uh, all-purpose flour right here. What I'm gonna do for the all-purpose flour with the baking soda. I'm gonna use a teaspoon of this baking soda here. Not too much. When you um, fry uh, the conch in it or dip the conch in that batter, it makes the conch a little fluffier. So what we're gonna do, I'm gonna take the conch, I'm gonna dip it in the egg wash. I'm gonna get that mix all around in there. Then I'm gonna take that, and get some of the egg and drip off there. So where did um, we get the conch from? Because I'm sure they can see that the conch is already oh. tenderized and we didn't tenderize it on camera. Yeah, I, um, I bought the conch at the fish market in Miami and I had them run it through the tenderizer three times. So the conch is already tenderized. So now, put a couple more in there. I'm just sitting in the uh, egg there. Just getting nice and wet. 
to be dried out and fried. And get it all mixed up in that nice flour. Get it nice and uh, mix up, become one with the flour. I got my uh, pot on the stove here with the oil. Got the oil heating up. There you go. Make that boy loose. In how much minutes? But cons don't take that long to cook. And if it, once you get once the pot is hot, you can turn it down so that the the cons don't burn. Because uh. Basically, just wanted to get a little bit in there and get right. Well, I'm about to take these out. I have a piece of napkin in the bottom of my pan to drain some of the oil to drain off. This is what we behemoths call good old crack on. Now, I'm about to crack this chicken. This was a chicken breast. This was a whole chicken breast. We bought the chicken breast with the bone in it. And all I did was just cut the, uh, the breast into thin strips. Into thin strips. And I'm gonna get my tenderizer. And I'm gonna tenderize it. tenderize that chicken and I put it in the um, egg wash Take that and I put it in the food. Now I'm already 
tenderize my chicken. Put them in this flour goodness here. Now I'm gonna let it drop in something hot and sexy. Folks, final product. I have a question. Who can tell me or can see the difference between the conch and the chicken? Uh, leave your comments to the bottom. Tell me uh, which side of the pan the conch is on, which side of the pan the chicken is on, or if it's mixed in between. But here's what. Here's the way we eat our conch. when we were back in the Bahamas. When we were back in the Bahamas and we used to go in a uh, you have a conch snack for extra with 50 cents or yeah 50 cents or a quarter yeah let me get some onions and some mayo on that we're having some onions you can tell that was some years right yeah for extra 50 cents that's way back in what in the 90s <laughs> Yeah, way back in the days. Yeah, it was the 90s, 1990s. What was the 90s? What was the 90s, honey? And some meal. I know Christine like plenty, uh, like plenty onions. Yep, have it on. And then, ketchup and some hot sauce. And then, there you go. You got a half a line. There you have it, folks. We have that uh, good old crack hunk. Give me a fork. Give me a fork. Me 
Again, we want to thank you for spending your evening with us. I'm sorry, guys. If you like, give me that thumbs up. Go ahead and subscribe if you didn't. Well, that's good. Leave me some comments. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Crack on with some of the onion. Mm. Oh man. Woo. Yeah, that's good. That'd make you wanna walk outside naked. <laughs> to make you wanna hop on the next flight out going out on. Yeah. If it was the COVID. Let me um get some of this lemon here. Get some of that good dish on it. But like I said, we want to thank you for spending your evening with us. Good old bean and crack dunk. And crack chicken. If you like the video, like I said, thumbs up. Hit that bell notification when we put another one up. We're going to try to put up some videos more frequently now. Um, if you haven't subscribed, Go ahead and subscribe. And as always, until we see you again or you come to us again, we thank you.